done taking homeschool photos. I am in Onalaska, Wisconsin, and I saw a little lookout and I said, I gotta stop and look at this amazing view of the river over the bluffs. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful here. I just wanna give you an update on the highs and the lows this week. My high this week was getting to cook some new healthy foods for my parents while I was visiting them. And my low for this week tied to that was that I had to pack up all my food and pack up all my recipes and everything that I needed to bring to their house. I am about ready to lose my mind. Food freedom is going good. I am doing good eating what I'm supposed to eat. But today is the first day that I need to pack and leave for a few days. And the kids are going crazy. They're sick. Maverick is crying about everything and now I have to pack all this food and I just want to go <laughs> my mom doesn't even have a blender so I have to bring the blender ah. real life right real life While it was a lot of work to get here, it has been amazing being at my parents' house for the last three days. It is so relaxing here. It's awesome to be able to get out of routine and go somewhere different and just be able to change it up a little bit. It has been so relaxing and the boys love it here. And the woods are beautiful and the fall colors are amazing even if there's snow mixed in right now. What do you think is in there? A bug! Can you see? It's red! Pretty cool, huh? Does it look like a little forest? Okay. Tiny trees. Being here has been great. When we got here, we just unpacked all our food, and then whenever it's meal time, I just pull out my menu, and we pull out and make what we need to eat for the meal, and it's really easy. It's been relaxing. It's super nice during the week to have everything set, but the day that I have to plan and get everything ready is really stressful. One day of stress and six days of relaxing and having everything planned is so much better than stress every day trying to make meals. This sign is not a good sign. I know that my parents have really enjoyed having us here and I know that my mom has enjoyed having me help with meals instead of her having to plan out all the meals while we're here. For We've been here for three days now but with the snow coming, we might be here for a fourth. So the nice thing is, is I have lots of leftovers for us to eat.
how am I feeling this week? I'm actually seeing a difference. I have a little bit more energy this week. I definitely still need to work on more sleep. JD is the guy that is a morning guy and he makes me go to bed at night. So when he's not with me like this weekend at my parents' house, I have a hard time going to bed on time. So I definitely failed at getting enough sleep but I can see that the more sleep I get, I got more sleep than I did last week and I am feeling more energized. One of my takeaways this week from the module, we were learning all about hormones and that men and women were not created equal. Men's hormone cycle is a 24 hour cycle and women's hormone cycle is a 28 day hormone cycle. So I learned a lot about what types of foods you can be eating during the different types of your hormone schedule that will help you have more energy and help you lose weight. So that was really interesting. I never knew anything about that. Thanks for following along guys. I have a three hour drive to get back home so I better get on the road. But look, look at this gorgeous view. Isn't it amazing?